Human beings. Whoa, 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 wait, don't flush, okay? Uh, let me at least introduce myself. I'm Pooh, or as most of you know me as. <sighs> now, before you flush me away, uh, let me tell you why I'm really useful. Recently, people have started eating me. I know that sounds gross, but hear me out. <clears throat> It's called fecal microbiota transplantation, or FMT. It's basically taking poo from a healthy person and giving it to someone with disease. Now, to understand how FMT works, we need to first look at the disease it's used to treat, Clostridium difficile infections. Clostridium difficile is a very extremely tough bacteria. In fact, in Latin, difficile means difficult. Um, kind of like when my parents, my Chinese parents used to call me, difficult. These infections are often caused by an overuse of antibiotics that kill off healthy gut bacteria. Now, healthy gut bacteria help keep harmful bacteria like Clostridium difficile in check by a process called bacterial interference. Now, when healthy bacteria is around, it, it uses up resources and food. But when there isn't enough healthy bacteria around, the Clostridium difficile has more resources, and so it becomes stronger and more powerful, and it can cause mild to fatal diarrhea. So this is the part where eating a piece of me, or FMT, is very useful. Taking poo from a healthy person means it's filled with healthy gut bacteria that can help fight off Clostridium difficile. Now, FMT is a little bit like cooking. Uh, let me show you, okay? So it first begins with shopping. We go shopping and we shop for a piece of poo from a healthy donor. <laughs> it's then screened for infections like HIV and hepatitis. We want to make sure we get the good ones, right? And then a specimen of about 50 to 100 grams is scooped up and placed into a blender. And then, it's then we dilute it with sterile saline. Oh, <laughs> and it's filtrated. A cup of poo, sir. Oh, 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 no. Oh, I'm so sorry. That was not supposed. Oh, that is not supposed to happen. Um, <laughs> oh, it is then fed to the patient through a nasal gastric tube, or through enema or colonoscope. And nowadays, it's even put into a pill form. Now, very quickly. Um, this treatment, FMT, it has huge, huge potential, very promising results. In fact, Clostridium difficile was originally supposed to be um, treated with an antibiotic called vancomycin. But a recent study has shown that while vancomycin can only treat about 25% of patients, FMT can cure over 85% of patients with Clostridium difficile infections. So it has really promising results and has the potential to treat many other diseases. So next time you take a poop, just, you know, take a huge bite. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.